eat carefully, check out the ingredient carefully, because nowadays sometimes they hide the ingredients, and you eat some wrong things, and you could still be sick. Hmm? Yeah. Always pray, give thanks before you eat. Huh? Thank God Almighty. Thank all the saints and sages and the goddesses who protect us. And thank all involved, visible and invisible beings who help to produce the food that you eat, the clothes you wear, the car you drive, the shoes to protect your feet. Okay, everything we use, we thank them all, all of those involved, okay, visibly and invisibly. Because it's not only humans who make your food, it's the bees, the worms, even the ants. Yes, they work very diligently for what we enjoy, okay? We have to give thanks to them and bless them. Mm? Uh, also invisible beings, they're helping also. There are garden uh, fairies. Huh? There are trees, spirits. There are Mother Earth's essence, the sun's warmth and blessing. Every time if I happen to see out of the window, really, nowadays really I don't see the sun that much. Especially they make me a new mobile home, I don't see the sun not much. <laughs> So whenever I open a window, I see the sun covered with trees and far, but I always give thanks. And I see the moon, I give thanks, however rarely. Before I live in Spain, I see them more often, because I live more in the open space, and the sun is always visible, and the moon also. Now I don't have, but I still can see them sometimes. And when I remember, I thank them mm. all the time. Mm. All the stars, yeah. The wind gods, <laughs> the rain gods, yeah, the water gods, the plants gods, the tree gods, they all contribute something yeah, conducive to our physical and mental uh, wellness and happiness and uh, everything. Yes, whatever they can, they contribute. So if we do some work for the world uh, to help others, don't feel like it's an obligation. Feel like a token of gratitude. Mm. We do own each other. If not in this lifetime, many other lifetimes. <laughs> okay? 